guys, this is York for TomTop.com. Um, recently, I was planning to move out from my old apartment where I shared with two of my friends. And I have found uh, a one place for my own. And I was, you know, uh, spent a lot of time and money designing the new house. And here comes a thing that troubled me for a very long time, whether to buy a new TV. Because uh, for me, not for me, for many, you know, uh, young uh, ladies or gentlemen, they really uh, spend not so much time on TV. Most of the time they will uh, use their computers or cell phones or any other smart devices. But somehow I still want to, you know, have this um, kind of very huge screen that allows me to, uh, uh, that allows me to, you know, a very uh, excit exciting uh, watching experience uh, when I want to see some, you know, uh, horror movies with my friends. So one of my colleagues uh, suggested me that I, uh, instead of buying a new TV, spending a uh, lot of money buying it. Uh, why not to DIY a mini home theater for myself? So here we are our leading roles today. The first thing you need is a replacement of your television. So uh, firstly comes our uh, 720 pixels HD projector of C80. It can provide you an even more uh, exciting and joyful watching experience than a TV because it is much more bigger and it will make you feel that you are actually in a theater. So, uh, what about our signal source? Then secondly comes our uh, TV box from MX10. The TV box, it, it is tiny, uh, portable, and all the functions you are expecting from a TV box it equips. And uh, finally, here comes our old friend. Uh, you may see him in many of my uh, last videos, previous videos. Uh, it is a very you know, efficient and useful uh, speaker, which we can attach it to our Mini, uh, to our mini theater, and I think he is a really a very good companion. Okay, now let's connect all these little guys, and to see how can I, can they uh, grow into a mini uh, home theater. Okay, now let's begin our journey of our DIY. So the first thing you need to do is to uh, connect the Power, uh, power cable, both of the projector and the TV box to a power unit. So, uh, if you Notice the blue light is on, that means the TV box is fully charged. And then let, there is a power button of the, on the uh, surface of the uh, projector. Let's turn it on. And when, when you open the projector, it will take three to five seconds to initialization. Okay, there is a rotating knob on the right side of our projector. Uh, you can use it to adjust the sharpness of the picture. Because our projector has a playing distance from 120 uh, centimeters to 400 centimeters. And as the distance grows longer, the uh, size of your picture is growing bigger as well from 38 inches to 138 inches. Now you see is a HD cable. Through this cable, you can connect the uh, projector to the TV box. Both of these two machines have a HD cable. You see the HD cable in the projector is here. Now let's 
plug this in and the HDV cable in the TV block is right here and also let's plug it in okay this is a uh, aux line cable uh, line in and line out uh, with the help of this uh, aux cable you can connect the S5 speaker to our projector although our projector has an inner sound unit but after all it is not so professional uh, comparing to our S5 so with, uh, with the help of this you can uh, play a more uh, clear sound and enjoy a much more beautiful sound effect okay, you see uh, we need to plug in this line in port to the projector and the other hand of the line we need to uh, plug in this aux out port okay now uh, all the all the cables are connected to the machine and now let's see how they perform in the world before using it you need to make sure that your TV box is under a, a Wi-Fi condition or you can directly use this uh, signal cable to realize the internet connection there are various kinds of signal sources are optional in this projector uh, for example our uh, USB source which allows the projector to directly uh, read your uh, media files uh, from your U disk or TF card and here follows our HD port this HD source uh, allows this projector to uh, read the signal from your TV or in this case our TV box and uh, we have our audio signal uh, and you can even connect your laptop to this projector by uh, the by this source okay now let's uh, turn on the HD source You see, uh, the whole image is not so clear, so we need to uh, use the focus ring to adjust the sharpness of the image. Okay, this is a remote of our uh, TV box. We can select a language, so let's go with English. Okay, this is the main main. Uh, UI of the TV box as you can see it's very neat and simple and equips of many uh, apps and functions for example uh, now let's open the YouTube This is your photo on top.com. As you can see, today I bring you another smartwatch, our Lane 4 Pro. Um, you see, the, uh, with the help of our S5 speaker, the sound effect is very clear and strong, and uh, the image of the projector is clear too, and uh, I think it is very good to use and convenient in this main UI uh, interface we can uh, check our apps we have downloaded now let's check our Play Store uh, with this uh, store you can download whatever you like and whatever you want to see or want to hear now let's check the storage of our MX10 this is clicking to the setting interface. Okay, now let's check the storage of our MX10. You see, let's click into the setting interface 
and slide down to the storage and reset. As you can see, there is altogether uh, 64 gigabytes of storage, and we have only uh, used about 7 gigabytes, so there are 57 gigabytes uh, available now. And uh, we can also change the language. You see, there is a, a little global uh, sign on the front. As you can see, we can there are wires of language are uh, optional from Chinese to English, French, Portuguese, Spanish, and uh, so much on. Welcome back. This is pretty much about today's review about these three, uh, this little mini home theater. Uh, I hope that I can, this episode can provide you an inspiration of how to, you know, make your own house more entertainment, more efficient, rather than buying some, you know, uh, regular things, regular electronic devices that most people do. Because the house is yours and the life is yours. I'm York, I will see you next time. Thank <music> you.